Beavers and Portraits of Canadiosity, David Suzuki. David Suzuki is known as one of Canada's leading environmentalists, biggest TV stars, and the current record holder for most oil company assassins dispatched. But did you know that, like many Canadians, he started out as a baby? Born in Vancouver in 1936, Suzuki's early life was spent surrounded by the things he would later become known for, trees, some books, and, of course, the climate. As Suzuki grew, it became clear that he was a prodigy. At 12, he'd already become captain of his school's recycling team and laid claim to the largest pile of mulch in the Northern Hemisphere. Mulch he fed with the corpses of hired killers sent back in time by oil companies to stop the precocious environmentalist. But, like all Canadians, his true dream was to be on TV. PhD in hand, Suzuki set out to become a star. However, due to the low-paying nature of Canadian TV, Suzuki was forced to spend 38 years working nights as a tenured professor of zoology just to afford rent. In recent years, Suzuki has courted controversy by stating that Canada should end immigration to help conserve our environment. Luckily, Suzuki was called out for being xenophobic by progressive luminaries like Jason Kenney. But despite the ups and downs, Suzuki is to be praised for pushing us towards environmentalism and also for never taking pleasure in the killing of hired assassins. This has been a Beaverton Portrait of Canadiosity.